Security First Corp. Safety through knowledge. How do I enable fingerprint authentication on Microsoft Authenticator? If you're wondering how to add an extra layer of security to your Microsoft Authenticator app using fingerprint authentication, you're in the right place. Let's break it down step by step. First, it's important to understand that the Microsoft Authenticator app itself does not directly support fingerprint authentication for logging into the app. However, you can use the fingerprint feature on your device to unlock the app, which is a common misconception. Here's what you can do instead. If you have an Android device, you can enable the fingerprint unlock feature for the Microsoft Authenticator app, but it might not work as seamlessly as you expect. Some users have reported issues where the fingerprint authentication fails and they have to enter their PIN code instead. To set up fingerprint unlock on your Android device for the app, you generally need to ensure that your device's fingerprint feature is enabled and set up. Here's how you can do it. Go to your device's settings and navigate to the security or lock screen section. Enable the fingerprint option and register your fingerprints. Open the Microsoft Authenticator app and go to its settings. Look for an option to enable biometric authentication or fingerprint unlock. If this option is available, select it to use your fingerprint to unlock the app. However, as mentioned, this feature may not work reliably for everyone, and you might still need to enter your PIN code to access the app. For iOS devices, the process is similar, but the integration with fingerprint or face ID is typically managed at the device level rather than within the app settings. In summary, while you can't directly enable fingerprint authentication within the Microsoft Authenticator app, you can use your device's built-in fingerprint feature to unlock the app. This method, however, may have some limitations and variability in performance. Always ensure your device and app are updated to the latest versions for the best compatibility. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.